percent corruption. Hold on, sneeze coming. Oh no, dude. Oh, you can see it. Gross. That's disgusting. I am so sorry about that. I am. I am so sorry you had to see how gross that was. And that's going to leave a weird cummy stain by my face that people are going to be like, Ooh, you think a dick? Maybe I did. I, maybe I did suck a dick. And and what if I did? What if I... What if I'm just out in Portland? Like, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Are those dicks? What the? Oh my god, they are dicks! Oh my god, I'm like, ah, oh, that's so funny that they look like cocks. And they are. Dude, imagine living at the dick house. Just like, and uh, I'm, I'm just gonna walk home, guys. Uh, oh, I'll, I'll walk with you home. We're having a great conversation. No, 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 I'm just gonna, you know, it's been really fun catching up with you guys, but I just, I'm just gonna walk home to my house. It's actually that way. Are you, it looks like you wanna go towards the dick house and there's only five people who live here so uh the belief that it can ward off evil spirits is deeply ingrained in the minds of Bhut Bhutanese people um they're even used in place of a scarecrow that is amazing imagine a horror movie where in the middle of it the guy just whips out a dildo and the demon's like ah <laughs> Oh my god, like the exorcist, that scene where she's chained to the bed and instead of throwing holy water on it, the priest just pulls and starts fucking her. No, no. Sexy little knee-high socks. Ooh. In the in the business shoes. And a back... This is a weird outfit. <laughs> this is such a weird outfit. In Bhutan, a bid to turn basketball from a royal sport to a national one. Hell yeah. What's the average height in Bhutan? 5'2"? Yeah, they're not they're not going so far. That's a bad decision, man. You don't want to you don't want this. You don't want this Bhutan. They're playing American music. This is that song, the dan 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 bing 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 bong bong bing dan. What are they eating? Spaghetti? <laughs> what? I'm sorry. It's just... It's this... This was not the impression I'm getting. They don't eat meat. Where are you getting the sausage? Is that cheese? I wonder... And then it's like very high altitude. I have so many questions. This is a Himalayan country. I have a lot of questions. Oh, you can see she's not wearing a bra. That's very interesting. <laughs> There's speaking English. What is okay? That's just such a trip, dude. Um, English is the medium of instruction. Th I, this is so good. N this is great news for me. <laughs> very. I'm. I'm a subscribe because this is very interesting stuff. I gotta know. So Chun Chunala, Chundala. They got. They're working out. This is so Americanized. What an interesting. It's like one of the most beautiful buildings I've ever seen in my whole life. It's got the it's got the marble and the wood, the dark the dark wood, the the floor to ceiling went the I want it. Ah, oh, those chairs look like shit though. Those chairs are not comfortable. If you if I if I fly across the world and your chairs aren't comfortable, I will fight you. I will make you my chair. I will I will lose my shit. I will lose my shit because I've just been in an uncomfortable seat on a plane for fucking forever. Do you know how big my ass is? Because I'm trying to stay lean and jacked and juicy and there's not a lot of butt meat left on my butt. And so what? There's no cushion for the pushing and there's nothing to sit on and I'm just putting bone on what? On what? The thinnest... Hold on. You guys got to take a look at it. The thinnest cushion available. Are you seeing these thin chairs? To be fair, I am a giant, big old fat American. And these are five foot two people. <laughs> if I went there, my ass would take up this entire couch. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Take it. <laughs> That's too small for me to. That is way too far small for me to bathe in. Or is that a bidet? Is that a bidet? That can't be a bidet. Hold on. Look at this. You wouldn't put a bidet right there, right? That's a bathtub. 
if that's a bidet, you are cleaning your ass in full view of the entire <laughs> of the entire suite. Look, look at that. Look at that dining room. That looks beautiful, and I like that. I want some of that. Look at the look at the designs. Look at the the thin chairs. I'm not liking the chairs, but it looks nice. It's got this is a nice place. I like it. It disappoints me that I won't be able to get any meat, but I like it. I oh, I don't even know what that is. I don't even. I want the green, and I want the slightly orangier than the yellow dip. I don't know what that is, but it looks good. You got extravagant looking fruits. You got the sickest pool I've ever seen in my life. The gym. Oh, I would. I would love it if these. Pe if this is a, a jacked and juicy people, I'm gonna be very happy. I need to. I need to know. Let's take a look. What is the muscle factory looking like? I'm not a fan of the carpet. How much money is here? Good God, this is a luxurious country. They got a Planet Fitness? What the fuck? How, Planet Fitness, how did you do this? How do you have a Planet Fitness in the Himalayas? That's badass. I would love, Is it, it's like one room. <laughs> it's like one room. <laughs> A lot of gyms. What is going on in this country? It's like 11,000 people here. They got like a bajillion gyms. That guy's shredded. What is going on here? Husband and wife. I hope they or their siblings. There are two people who are shredded together. I'm moving. There's low crime. There's jacked dudes. What more could you want? <laughs> they've got Captain. Uh, they've got the most expensive weights known to man. They've got ladies with big backs. Look at this big back lady. But are you, look at this. Look at these jacked, handsome dudes. Look at these jacked, handsome old ladies. I'm in, I'm into this place. I could be here. They've got boxing. Let's go. Arrgh, I'm into this. I am so into this country right now. Fitness and car wash? That's actually brilliant. They need car washes? They speak English. They lift weights. That's pretty sick. <laughs> I think this is awesome. Suja, which is a butter tea. I have had it before in China, but I, I think it was a little different. Mmm. Oh, it's it's a little bit salty, and. It, <laughs> you can tell he doesn't like it a little bit. <laughs> He's like, mmm. It's it's salt. Mmm. Oh, it's it's a little bit salty. There's a tension. Okay, perfect. Oh, I can, yeah, I can point see. it out. It, look at the upper part of his eyeballs. There is an ease and a relaxation because he's had Butter this tea. before. See, I have calm. had it before he likes this. in China. Very calm. But I, I think it Relaxed was a little different. Eyelids. And I can, yeah, take I can smell the tea in there and let me taste it. <laughs> the second he looks back up, he's like, <laughs> almost like, mm, I'm tasting, I'm tasting. Uh oh. <laughs> Mmm. Oh, it's it's a little bit salty. And <laughs> the, he's like paralyzed. Top floor, staircase. Oh my God! Look at the mar. You know how I feel about marble, and they got the bidets. That's how you know it's a it's a high class country. It's also how you know they got spicy ass food, and they need to take care of their butt hole. In the next episode, Seychelles. Goodbye. <laughs>